the federal court um, has already ruled that the Pennsylvania congressional maps are constitutional. What's so um, novel, I mean, even revolutionary about this, is, is that the Pennsylvania State Supreme Court, on a five to two partisan decision, the five Democrats versus the two Republicans, has decided that they want new congressional maps in the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. Now keep in mind, we've already had three elections with these maps and nobody ever challenged them in court. It, it, it seems to me that uh, perhaps because of the Trump agenda, they want to change the lines and representation in Pennsylvania now. Why didn't anybody file a challenge back when we actually passed this legislation? When we passed this map in the House, it was a 136 to 61 vote. It was a bipartisan vote. 100 Republicans voted yes, 36 Democrats voted yes. The bill could not have passed without Democratic votes because you need 102. Four Democratic congressmen, Congressman Altmaier, Congressman Doyle, Congressman Brady and Congressman Holden all uttered support for this particular map. So we had a bipartisan vote in the, in the House of Representatives. Now the key is, is, does the Pennsylvania Supreme Court, which my understanding is, is no other state Supreme Court has ever done this, challenged federal congressional maps and said they're going to redraw them. It's such a bold stroke of a, of a super legislative action, which is not what the courts are supposed to do. And I just think we're going to have to see if the Supreme Court, the United States Supreme Court, stays or stops the actions of the Pennsylvania Supreme Court. The U.S. Supreme Court, as you know, is actually dealing with congressional map cases in front of it, uh, which is the appropriate place to, to address this. And keep in mind, the lower federal court already upheld or said our maps were valid. If we have to draw new maps, we'll draw new maps. I mean, there's, if the standards have changed after 200 years, then the standards have changed. Typically, you do those change in standards through a constitutional amendment. But if the court has decided on a five to two partisan basis, five Democrats to two Republicans, that they're going to take over how maps are supposed to be drawn through a court order, which I think is a real taking over of power from the legislature. I, I do. I, I think this is expansive judicial activism. But if we have to do it, we have to do it. And, uh, and, and we will definitely do it.